Hey there, Brett Troublemaker Comics here with another G.I. Joe Amer Real American Hero comic book review number five. Um, as I was thinking about this review, I've been kind of lenient on the practicality of real life scenarios and stuff like that in comics. Um, so this one, this, uh, Issue, I might be a little bit harsher on it because, well, technically, because, um, maybe I am going over a little overboard on the, uh, um, real life application to this. Um, chewing gum and talking at the same time, you know, and then. Again, chewing gum, talking at the same time, and then this was like old 50s um, intelligence, you know, x-ray machine, taking a picture and stuff like that, and then um, reading that very plainly. You know, and then this scene here has binoculars. Cobra Commander sitting, uh, shooting at paper targets, and the targets couldn't be more than 20 feet away, 30 feet, and then he just stands up and just hits them right across the chest, real easy. Don't get it. And the way if I read it correctly, and they had a one day prep time, and yet they managed to do the Nautilus um, to capture in this uh, in this issue. I mean this page. You can see where um, they try to capture a tank. With um, little or no planning, I don't know. And then you have this guy here. I'm not understanding if that was a a significant character, or they were poking fun at somebody, a famous person, or something, because it makes no sense. But he might be a politician that just wanted in on the conversation, so who knows? And then having traffic go in front of a parade, it didn't make sense. Normally they have streets blocked off and it's all one way. So like I said, I'm being really, really picky or mean or Critical, uh, and then they're trying to escape, and they hide in within the uh, abandoned or a construction site. All they had to do was just walk in, take a quick peek, and they didn't. And then they're running around in band uniforms with uh, machine gun and bazookas and yet where are the police so uh, like I said I'm being a little mean I guess and they just cap in the capture them and then as they're walking down walking them back in front of the uh, parade route they decided to do an animal house thing and crash into the uh, the whole uh, grandstand and just hat load and behold there's Cobra Commander hiding all the time right underneath General Flag. Now if that was to happen in real life court martials senate hearings stuff like that how could you let him get away blah 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 Yada yada yada. And 
once again, bad guy gets away, good guy has an issue or a moral dilemma, and then the joke of uh, to make him feel better, a little uh, outwitted cobra with a uh, bubble gum. The whole time that this is happening, and all the issues that I've read so far, uh, General Flag, he never takes off his sunglasses. Or their glasses, I don't know. But, anyways, it's an interesting read. Like I said, maybe I'm being too uh, mean on my review. But, you know, I'm seeing a lot of uh, stuff that does not make sense. But it is a comic book series, and yeah, I know. You have to bend the uh, rules a little bit to tell the story in comic books, so. But, anyways, let me know what you think of this issue. Let me know what you think of the video channel and all that good stuff. So, thank you for watching. And until next time, take it easy. Stay out of trouble. Bye.